What's up guys, this is Harai 7 rct bringing you another video. Uh, bring the music down here for a bit. Uh, hopefully the audio is going to be working fine. Um, what can I say guys, this is another State of Affairs video. I haven't done one, of, I, I think I actually did just one, uh, I think a few years back. Uh, after the some big changes took place for myself and RCT uh, and here I am doing another one um, I wanted to make this as the best as possible that I could in terms of being like an open conversation for you the viewers out there uh, subscribers um, people who uh, follow me on Twitter and social media uh, friends actually uh, those who are very close as well as those who we casually meet and interchange opinions and stuff like that on the internet I'm going to address all of you guys um, RCT has come to a point where there is a lot of things going on it's always been that way um, you guys know that uh, sometimes I have to go online on Twitter and apologize because at a certain point I cannot keep up with the whole work schedule and everything and in order to bring and upload content as much as I would love to that has been going on for a while ever since I made the move down to Pennsylvania and most of you who follow me know that for a fact um, I've been trying my best to work at it um, Afrosaw and I uh, have been trying to brainstorm different ways to you know just try to be a little bit more consistent and stuff but the work schedule it just keeps grinding and grinding on and on and it's very difficult but that's not why I'm here because that's something that comes with the territory um, I'm here more to tell you guys give you a little bit of background on several different topics that have to do with RCT I hope I don't bore you guys to death please I ask you to stay here for a while bear with me and I promise that hopefully from this video on things will start changing for the better now first off I, I for those of you who are tuning in who just came into this and, and saying who the hell is this guy and what is RCT all about RCT was something that came up with very very closely and very personal it, it came out to be or it came to be between uh, a very dear person of mine um, and you know in more ways than one uh, Afroso uh, those of you who do not know who Afroso is Afroso to me and basically as far as RCT is concerned she's the other half of the whole operation if you can call it that um, those of you who um, I share a very good and intimate uh, friendship with, uh, case in point, like Aaron Classic Gamer and Anthony and Glowing Rice and so on and so forth, you guys know, so I don't have to explain too much, but basically she is the other half, the half that you hardly ever get to see because she, uh, right now, she is in Puerto Rico and um, we're trying to work our things to be able to bring her here and we can continue as a whole as a team like we always uh, have been and that is one of the many examples of things that is going on in the background that is really making it difficult for me to bring content the way that I want to but first off because I want to go in order the first thing is what is RCT what is the purpose of RCT since the very beginning guys I've never intended to be a YouTube superstar um, never intended to because in the end all that I am is basically another uh, a tech fan another gaming fan above everything else metalhead of course um, kind of on the yeah on, on, on that kind of stuff I just had to put this in here. This is a, a present from Andrew, so, and it's just awesome. I mean, coffee, skulls, swearing, it's all, it's all very me. Okay, back to the point. 
the whole concept of RCT was to simply come out as a gamer, uh, be there with you guys, uh, check out the latest stuff, and just share my opinion, how I feel with the game, interacting with the game, be it a review, be it a, a preview, a showcase, a one of the many uh, stuff that I tried to bring out, like Backlog Blues, or Shoot 'em Up Crossfire, or even a sort of aggression, which is Beat 'em Ups. I try to bring these things to you guys, not as from the angle of a uh, wannabe superstar, YouTube superstar, but more like a regular Joe who has been, and that is the point that I differentiate myself from the others is that just like many of you, thousands of you, maybe more out there, has been from the beginning of the gaming, you know, of the gaming industry, so to speak, you know, the revival after the NES days, you know, um, and it's just an average Joe, just wanting to be there and share with you guys and have a little bit of fun. Now, the way this came to be, Afrosaw and I, we're looking for ways to bring something out of the RCT branding. The RCT branding in the beginning was something that started off as a small business, uh, Renegade Computer Tech, and it was something that started in Puerto Rico as a small business of um, custom building, repairing, and everything on the hardware side of PC. And PC gaming, of course. Um, it's something that I, I really enjoy doing. I wish I could do more from here. Again, I don't have the time to. And from there, basically, it turned more into a gaming spin because at the time, uh, business was a little bit slow. I did get my, my customers and stuff, but it wasn't really heading towards where we could, you know, just sit back and relax because it really wasn't making much in terms of business. So from there, given that my passion is gaming, and so it is to Afro Soul uh, up to an extent, we decided to try something. Let's go with the Twitch streaming. And it was something that she was very adamant that I would try. I was very hesitant because I'm not a kind of person who enjoys being in the spotlight. I do, however, enjoy and appreciate quality reason why I stick to doing overlays and making um, art for the thumbnails and stuff like that because I enjoy art a lot as well. Now, that is the basic concept of it. I know it doesn't um, garner a lot of attention. I know it's not going to skyrocket me to the, you know, uh, the millions of subscribers and stuff like that. I wish it did. It would be nice, I mean, to experience that, but that's not what I'm basically here for what I do enjoy and I get out of this and I do not want to lose is having that contact with you guys meeting new people being able to interact that is something that has been lacking as of late as of uh, these last two years since I came here because I've been limited to doing only recordings and that's something that I want to change in the short term future hopefully it will happen but as it has, as it, as it is right now, um, ironies of ironies, you know, um, ready computer tech. Right now, the computer that I build, that it has been the basically the the the, the pillar of the RCT hardware side, the beast. It's a computer that I made a few years ago, and I try to future-proof it as much as I could back then is uh, giving me a series of, of trouble and, and problems that I'm not able to resolve on a financial um, standpoint. So as of right now, I'm very limited with the hardware. I'm using my gaming laptop, which I use as a backup. So as you see, you know, um, in terms of uh, those who are used to seeing my videos and stuff and see that I have like a lot of flashy intros and transitions and stuff like that, it's lacking because I had to just start from scratch, install a whole bunch of software that I didn't have on the laptop to bring this to you guys. Now, that is not gonna limit as much. It will limit on some aspects. Of course, the first thing that is gonna be affected short term is I'm not gonna be able to cover as much Switch games as I want because 
as it um, is right now, the laptop that I have, the gaming laptop, is NVIDIA base, the GPU side, and it does not play well with my capture card, which is an Aver Media. On the driver side of things, it is a pain in the ass. It keeps giving me blue screens and stuff like that, and I cannot work like that. So, for the time being, as far as that is concerned, uh, soon, uh, hopefully in a week or two, um, I'll be having my vacation time. I'll be asking at least for two days, which I'm going to sit down and work my way to different solutions on the beast to see if I can get it back to working because the problem on the beast right now is on the graphics card area everything else is working fine CPU RAM motherboard everything because I have taken care of the beast even though I have put her to hell because um, the hardware that has that powers the beast is basically um, R9 280X which is not really built for 4k gaming and I've gotten away with 4k gaming as you guys know from uh, some of the videos that I've done in the past now it's come to a point where the, the, the graphics card just won't take it anymore and they're giving up on me now I still have some stuff to do because of course as a tech guy I like to eliminate different options I like to go down to a list of different troubleshooting stuff but I need time for that and that's why I'm coming here to tell you guys I'm sorry that I'm taking a lot of time to get back into action I uh, appreciate your patience I know that that was a little bit long-winded to tell you that but yeah you know I'm trying my best here I have limited time limited resources and to answer a question which I know that I'm going to start getting as soon as I hit Twitter or after I upload this is why don't you go to patreon why don't you set up something like a GoFundMe and stuff like that to be completely honest I really don't I mean I respect uh, people who go that route and I understand the benefits of it it could really help like right now if I set up something and I am able to get the resources to get a graphics card for the beast it would solve the issue right away but Patreon, for example, I don't have anything against Patreon, but right now with my limited time, I feel that above everything else, I, I'm a responsible person, or I try as hell to be. If I set up a Patreon, I am already setting myself up to have an obligation to give a certain quality content for um, the patrons, of course, who are going to be funding my activities and... I wouldn't want to fail them at any level so given that it's been on my own very hard to consistently bring and upload stuff I wouldn't want to fail them at any given point so it's something that I haven't explored to the maximum yet I haven't uh, explored it but that's how it is so in the meantime if um, if you guys have any suggestions uh, how I can go about or if you guys know of uh, any dealers or anybody who could sell these cards um, I'm in the market right now if I'm going to uh, acquire a new card it'll be top of the line something like NVIDIA 1080 Ti so if you guys know of places where I can like get it for a very good price I would appreciate it um, but that's the reason why I don't go that route maybe in the future who knows if I get enough time to start different projects and I need for those projects um, some extra resources that I cannot get on my own with my current job then maybe but for the time being time is a factor that is not allowing me to go that, that and it's more because I don't want to fail now that out of the way what can you guys expect then from RCT in the short term and on the long term well basically the long term is very closely tied with AfroSoul's future in RCT. And what I what I mean by AfroSoul's future is that right now we're focusing on bringing her here, on tying everything up that she has a tie up in, in Puerto Rico. Uh, later we'll have video 
with her present, which I would feel more comfortable, I know she would as well, to talk to you guys um, more about, you know, how we came to be with all of these things that are going on. But for now, needless to say, is basically that, you know, she's going to make the move over here once she's here and we have everything settled, the things that we need to do. Then we're going to go back to full, you know, throttle in terms of RCT, the streaming, um, bringing the team ups again. You're going to see us doing videos together, like, uh, at, at a certain point back in the day for multiplayer games and stuff like that. And, um... And yeah, once we get, the, let's say, the Beast 3.0 ready on that side, the hardware side, uh, make some time, which is something that we're both working on. Uh, later, uh, I'll give you a little bit more information on that later. But at least for peas, anybody who's really uh, interested and enjoying the content, don't worry. We're on top of it. We're trying our best to, to make it through. And in short term, RCT, what you're going to be seeing due to the hardware issues and, and the lack of time and stuff like that, you're going to be seeing me go back to basics in the sense that I'm going to be going back for a little time, going back to um, emulation, going back to uh, more indie games because it's very limited what I can play for you guys on PC given the hardware that I'm using right now. And, um, yeah, but I'm not going to stop doing the gaming thing. I might actually try in the next few weeks going back to Twitch and doing some streaming for you guys for some wacky games that I have in my backlog. And I think we're going to enjoy that interaction. And lastly, I would like to say um, to you guys, uh, God, I don't know how to say this, but thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much for not only uh, standing by RCT and at least checking from time to time the videos and leaving a comment and even responding to the tweets that I do on, on Twitter. Really appreciate you guys. There's a long list of people, uh, both old school and newcomers that, that are coming around. RCT appreciates all of you guys. That's the whole point of doing this. You know, we want to get together with like-minded people gamers be it old school or new generation we're not gonna you know discriminate on that side the angle of delivery the angle the reason why i'm here is because i'm throwing that out there in my angle from an old school game but it doesn't really matter what we are trying to do here is a community foster a community where there's no trolling where there's no console wars where everybody can enjoy their stuff respect each other and just have some some good old fun you know enjoy stuff i'm not here to brag about my incredible skills even though anthony i know that you're out there thinking and dreaming about me winning one of those evos and stuff like that give it time give it time i still got my arcade stick there and and, and with the coffee with the death wish and swearing and shit i'll I'll get there one of these days. So, guys, that'll be all for now. Um, I hope you um, like, enjoy what RCT has to offer, even though it's a bit limited for the time being. The sky's the limit. I mean, actually, you know what? I, I had this background here. I had intended, but I kind of... There you go. Gaming, guys. That's what it's all about, and... RCT hopes to be here in the long term. I hope that you are there with us to enjoy the ride and support us the best way you can, either by liking, subscribing, commenting, throw me a, a comment on Twitter, uh, interaction, anything, you know. Just let's have fun. Let's have fun together. Let's enjoy the games. We're coming to a point where gaming is starting to get crazy. There's a lot of innovation that is coming just around the corner, and hopefully you and I will be there together to see it through. So that'll be all for now, guys. Take care. See you soon. And remember, RCT will be whole again very soon. Peace.